Never in a million years did I ever think I would be invested in a case such as Idaho 4. And the snowball effect that's come with it. We have Samantha and her mom. Um, I'm just going to put it out there. I spoke with her mom for two hours tonight. And what an awesome, amazing woman and a great mom. Samantha is very lucky to have Katina as her mom. Katina does defend her situation. A lot of people do not know what her situation is. People will assume that it's the timing. The timing. Who cares about the timing and when it is? Okay? Clout? No. There's none of that as well. Okay? If a child needs validation, it doesn't matter how old the child is. In Samantha's case, what she longs for, it's apparent. She longs for validation. <clears throat> and I'm not talking out of my ass here. I'm really talking based on the truth that Katina has told me. <clears throat> I am absolutely disgusted. SG was never there for Samantha. Never. Okay? Never, never, never. If anything, he made her... Made her tell or lack thereof, he made her pretend that she's not his daughter. Like she said, you know what, if anybody approaches you, you don't know anything, you don't... <sighs> it's so messed up. It's seriously so messed up. There's so many things that Katina has told me tonight. I will never... <clears throat> so don't come to me. Don't come to me and ask me what she said. There's a lot of private things I am not going to share with you guys. Now, if Katina wants to do a live with me um, sometime here on TikTok and share her story with her mouth share her story. I don't want to be the one saying her story for her. Um, but I will say that all the people that are coming with the wrong comments, your comments are insensitive. You don't know the situation. Okay. But if Katina wants to go into the public, um, officially, I can definitely help her with that. Um, all she has to do is ask me. That's fine. She has she has my number. Well, she doesn't have my number. I'm going to give it to her, though. But we were talking on Messenger. I'm going to give her my number anyways. But um, but I'm in Canada. She's in the States. So <laughs> that's why I said, well, message me on Messenger. It's better and easier. Um, the whole fact of the matter is, is that, like I said in the previous video, Samantha needs to be acknowledged she is a Gonzalez blood through Steve so Samantha deserves a voice and I don't want to see as soon as she starts talking people try to give her backlash or assume she's here for the wrong reasons she's not she's not Um, you know, I'll always, and this is what I told Katina tonight. I said, I'll always, always, and even Katina agrees. We will always empathize with the Gonzalez's for losing Kaylee and Maddie. Um, because they acknowledged Maddie as her daughter and her being so close to Kaylee, of course, of course they, sh they should, right? Um, but when they keep saying, 
we have five kids. Technically, Steve has six. So, you know, um, they never acknowledged her as being the older, the older sibling. Olivia is not the oldest. Um, and like, I'll always empathize. I'll always empathize with the Gonzalez's for, for losing Kaylee. But we don't know how they are behind closed doors, right? We don't know. Um, all of us can assume the best, but really, we don't know anything. And based on what I heard tonight, we really don't know anything. We don't know anything, and I'm not going to go into it. As I said, this video is longer than what it should be, but... I really wanted to put my two cents out there. Um, so, I mean, if Katina wants, um, her and I can go live um, anytime, and I'd like to get her story out. Um, or I can just do um, kind of like an interview thing and record it and just post it on my YouTube. I can do that as well if she doesn't want to go live live. But I don't know. I don't know. I think this video is like whatever. You, if you guys have new are new here, sorry, I ramble and I think out loud. But those that know me know. <laughs> so thanks for sticking around. Um, but Katina and Samantha, you guys have my support, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. I'm here for you guys. Um. You guys deserve to be heard. Samantha needs to be heard. Samantha needs to be validated. And that is what's most important. It's Samantha. And this is aside from justice. For justice, right? We know Idaho 4 deserve their justice. But Samantha lost her half-sister. And she's never been allowed to grieve. Or go to the memorial. She wasn't allowed. 